Kalau bin an, Abay sa dari ma'am. Mambalay gamay tayo. Ako si DC S Paraguso. Nagpuyo sa Puruk 7 Poblacion Salvador Lanao Norte. 31 years old. Isa ko ka housewife. Ang upat ka buhok akong anak. Ay, stay to the end. Isaya po, isaya po. Wala man kay na may tambal. Matagan po ko vitamins mga bata. Apo ko yung vitamins. Pero katong ni Agi, di ba wala yung doktor? Katong ni Agi ba? Katong yun kay Buragwan. Lisod. Mato yung lisod kay wala yung doktor. Wala pa to si Dok na kondisyon. Kaya ko na kay Maminti ang among doktor dito sa Poblacion Salvador, Lano del Norte. O nahina o tulunta ako na Madungagan ang tamba, libreng tambal o mga staff sa center uh, number one dentist or uh, mid-tick para dili na misig at sa ospital na check up sa muhang dugo o um, ihi naku kay kong pasalamat karon na Gianhi juga ko sa mo ang balay Gitis to face juga nila Ang interview Sa health worker O kining mga Estudyante bisa gula ko Kaila sa ila Daku kay kong pasalamat Na ning abot sila karong adlawa
bagong tadili kay bagong sila lupo na mau nga ako yung una ko ang tatalakayin ay tungkol sa JPS yung mga pinakailangan yung malaman sa Hello everyone, I am Dr. Al Harvey Villorio from RHU Salvador, Lano del Norte. And gusto ko pong sabihin na napaka-bless ko ng Salvador. Kasi po, andito po yung mga scholars natin. Sina Doc Raiden, Doc Larry, at saka Doc Milfred. Um, since day one po, napaka-porsigido po ng mga scholars natin. At saka ang daming mga cases po na na-meet nila during sa ating consults, even sa community immersion natin. So, Uh, hindi ko po uh, masabi kung ano na po nangyari sa akin kung wala itong mga scholars natin dito. Kasi po, uh, during those times na nandito sila, para <laughs> sobrang toxic talaga. Uh, anyway, that's the usual um, toxicity naman dito na sa Aritya namin. So, um, hindi, hindi kami nagkulang na uh, bigyan sila ng cases na ma-expose sila. At saka, they, ano naman, they did well, they did it well, the, the physical exam, the history taking, and even I tried them doing their own man, uh, I, I tried commanding them doing their own management and supervising them as well, and they really did it um, right and well, so I really hope one of these doctors um, will serve Arichu Salvador in the future. And I'm betting on maybe the Cradles. Kasi siya yung pinakamalapit dito. Ah, si Doc Milfred pala. Sa Baroy. So, but anyway, whoever will be assigned here, um, Salvador is very open to, to have you guys be serving here in the future. And I hope um, you will not forget all the lessons that we learned here. Makikita naman yan sa mga documentations nila. Napaka daming experiences talaga. And I would like to congratulate um, the Department of Health for sending this um, excellent um, DTTV scholars here in Salvador. And napaka successful po talaga ng summer immersion program na ito. Thank you so much and once again, God bless to, to these scholars and God bless to the viewers. Hi, I'm your friend Christian Osonatorio. Hi. I'm Ryan Tracy Irani.
Hi, I'm Larry Senador and an incoming third year medical student of Middle State University College of Medicine. And what I can say is that this is truly an experience of a lifetime. It's, it's full of good memories. It's the RHU Salvador at the same time the MGU is very accommodating for the learning. It has been amazing. I've, I've learned so many things that would be helpful for me as a future DDTB and I hope the future DDTB scholars will be able to, ex to experience part of experience here in Salvador Lano de Tar. And I would really treasure this experience for you.